Hi everyone! In this video, I wanted to share with you the three things that I believe you should keep in mind when you are buying your first colored pencil set. Now the first tip is to know what kind of subject you wish to be drawing. Now when I began with my colored pencil art, I knew that I like to draw birds and often on maybe some botanical art. And also that my style leaned towards the realistic. Now for this, I needed pencil that would let me get in a lot of details in my drawing. So for example, if you want to be a wildlife artist or a botanical artist, where you want to be including a lot of details, then you might want to go for oil-based pencils. But for example, what interests you is still life or landscapes, where there's more flat areas to be covered quickly. Then backspace pencils, which give you easier coverage, might be just the thing for you. So the second tip that you need to keep in mind is the availability of open stock of whichever brand that you pick. Sorry, open stock means uh, availability of each individual color. So when you begin your drawings, for example, in my, in my bird drawings, I tend to run out of browns and greens very quickly. So I need to replace those and not have to buy an entire set all over again. So open stock availability is extremely important and actually that depends, that differs from country to country. So in India, Faber-Castell Polychromos open stock is quite easily available. On the other hand, Prisma Color open stock is not very commonly available and there are actually a lot of colors that I have not yet been able to find. So that is one thing you might want to keep in mind because you will end up wanting to replace some of the more commonly used colors in your drawings and when you reach that stage where you run out of one particular color you cannot buy a, a, a whole new set you need to replace that one color so availability of open stock is the second thing that you need to keep in mind now the third thing that you need to keep in mind is the affordability so what i mean is there are some brands which are more affordable than others and and a lot of artists will recommend that to get really good drawings or paintings you should maybe buy less but go for the high-end art materials but what i believe is that you should focus on the middle part and don't go for the really cheap art supplies which is actually meant for school kids and that's available in your local stationery store but also don't worry about you know investing money in the really high in art supplies and there's also no point in investing in an expensive art supply and then worrying about wasting it especially when you're beginning and you're learning so keep in mind what you can afford what you can afford to waste when you're learning and keep that as an important factor in your mind when you are picking your favorite color pencil brand now I want to show you some of the brands I currently have. So the first one that I have is, is a Kohinoor. Uh, this is called Polycolor. And uh, so, so I actually have the gray pencil set because I just want to try it. And so this one's actually quite affordable. Um, this 12 pencil set was for 1100 rupees. And, and they're actually oil-based pencils. They're quite hard. If you're starting out and you just want to experiment with colored pencils and you want to try drawing detailed uh, work with colored pencils, then I think this is a good way to go. Um, the open stock is available in India and I'll put all the details of its availability in my description. My second set is this Prisma color and this is actually my first set. I This is a 72 pencil set that I bought and this was if I'm not wrong, it's already been four years. I think it, I bought it for around five to six thousand. And these are pretty good pencils. There are some colors here which you will not find in any other uh, you know, color pencil brand. These are backspace pencils. So these are great for landscape, still life, and even for botanical and wildlife art. The only problem is because they're backspace pencils, they will lose their tip very quickly. So you will need to do a lot of sharpening. Um, it's hard to maintain a point with these pencils. Then I have these Derwent drawing pencils. Again, these are extremely, uh, these are backspace pencils. Again, also very soft and 
but they have some good colors and especially in my wildlife drawings not for the detailed work uh, but I do use them frequently for my wildlife drawings for some of the colors that I could not find in polychromos I found in Durban so so yeah it's good for that Durban actually has a wide range of colored pencils I have the drawing and another pencil that I have is the Durban Lightfast and I actually just bought two of these because I wanted to try them. These Durban Lightfast are oil based pencils and they are, they are absolutely great. Um, you can sharpen them to a very, you can sharpen them to a good point. Then of course is my favorite castell polychromos. Um, I bought a 60 color pencil set and then I supplemented that with a lot of open stock colors as and when I needed them. My one final tip for you when you go shopping for your colored pencils is that do not worry about buying uh, the bigger sets of like maybe 120, 150 colors. Uh, I, I would suggest that you start again with, a, with the middle path. Uh, don't buy the 12 pencil set because that's very basic. But, uh, but maybe something like a 30 pencil, 32 pencil set or maybe like a 60 pencil set is, is good. Um, you'll have enough colors to, have a, to be able to do a good drawing. And, and if you like the pencil brand, if you like the pencil, if you like how it works for you, you can always supplement it with open stock. So, so yeah, there you have it. I hope this is helpful. And if you have any more questions, you can drop them in the comments below. If you like this video, please um, like, subscribe and share with your friends. If there's a specific topic on which you would like me to make a video uh, related to colored pencils, please drop it in the comments again and I will absolutely try to do that.